first one is this. When he, when this all, he starts turning this way or whatever, I'm turning my chin, my shoulders come into the middle of the, of the triangle, right? I'm constantly readjusting my feet. If I let them slip, I think, oh, that's Josh's hip bones. I know that the minute I connect to those hip bones, I've got way more connection versus here. Here you can, here you can clear my feet really easy. That half inch is just huge. So I want to be on these so I'm connected. But he starts stacking his weight on like these guys do. When he starts to clear one leg, if he pushes his leg to the ground, if I want to stay in guard, I can go here. I go under him and I stay here. Drop your weight with me. And I will end up by switching that guard, by switching that leg inside, I will end up usually in full guard. And you can just feel what you want here as to which position you, you want to try and play to. If the foot stays on the outside, the danger is I get stuck in a half guard. There we go. So we're just here, we're going super slow. Let's, you know, start to come this way, we're sure. Yeah. Start to get the side. Just here. So it's forcing this between. When he starts forcing this between, like, now we've got both underneath. This is better for me. Wrong time on my side, this is better for me because when he extends, I can generally get this back in and look what I have every time. So now I have all the inside position. Does everyone see that? And now we're into our game of the arm postures. So what I'm trying to do is maintain all the major real estate. Yeah. If the if the foot ends up if the foot ends up as we're stacking, put the weight on. Keeping the, I'm keeping the hands down, the fingers together as much as I can. Starts to clear. If I end up here, right? What tends to happen here is watch my legs. I'm going to end up having to. He's going to cross face me and all this. I'm going to be lifting his backside up to get my leg out. That allows my bottom leg. That he's putting the half guard to get out. So I'm kneeing him up the back side, I'm kind of doing a scissor sweep idea. It's almost like a scissor sweep in reverse. I'm doing this, which then allows me to come up on the single, and now I'm getting up on top. Any questions on that at all? So, so, so I've shown you've got two bits in one, which is not ideal, ideal is in one, but it gives you different positions that you can you can go to, like on what feels better for your body. You might prefer to go to the guard, you might prefer to um, go, go to the half guard, but, but if you're gonna go to the half guard, one thing I say about you, if you go to the half guard, if he sits on your legs, it's, he's kind of like playing your arms above here. And really what I'd like to do is burrow under him. Because if I can get underneath him, he's got big problems. He's got nowhere to land, basically. Any, any questions on that at all? Anything? No? We'll mix it up again. Um, so, so these questions arise on this as we're going along. It's just, we're still in the intro phase, then let's just get it answered. Yeah, we'll just fire it next. There we go.